Hi there! We continue to review important news in digital health from all over the world. If you'd like to be one of the first to find them out, subscribe to our channel. And now let's get straight to the most interesting news that happened in June. After a horrible decision by the Supreme Court to overturn Roe v. Wade, digital health companies reacted to that immediately. For example, period tracking app Flow announced right away it will add anonymous mode. We will do everything in our power to protect the data and privacy of our users, Flo said, and we take our hats off to support that. An important study published by JMIR, many venture-backed digital health startups aren't clinically robust, as measured by the number of regulatory filings and clinical trials. These results highlight a significant opportunity for companies to differentiate themselves and for customers to demand greater validation for the products and services they purchase. Auckland-based health technology startup Alimetry has received clearance from the US FDA for its wearable device for diagnosing gastric disorders. Gastric alimetry is a non-invasive test for common stomach disorders including nausea and vomiting, gastroparesis, and functional dyspepsia. At WWDC of 2022, Apple has presented multiple healthcare and fitness features and enhancements. Check out our company's review of this news on our website. That's all we have for you by now and hope July will bring us more breaking events in digital health. Take care.